Japan's population has fallen by nearly 1 million in the past five years, in the first decline since the census began in 1920. This is bad news for the country's shrinking economy, which is unable to depend on an expanding labor force to drive growth. Its population is shrinking as well as aging. In urban areas, the birth rate has fallen far below replacement rate. In Tokyo, it is below even the very low rates recorded in Italy and in Spain. The population now stands at 127.1 million, declining 0.7% between 2010 and 2015. The latest census showed that the figures show the population is shrinking in 39 areas of the country, and growing in 8. Japan's nine major urban areas account for 53.9% of the total population, with Greater Tokyo now home to 28.4%. Rural areas, on the other hand, are being hit by severe declines. Population growth is shrinking faster than any other country in the world and is falling faster than originally predicted. Demographers originally predicted that the population of Japan would peak at 130 million in 2011 and then decline to 105 million in the year 2050 and drop to 67 million by 2100. Now it looks as if the 130 million mark will never be reached and the population will fall between 82 million and 99 million by 2055. Japan's population is expected to fall by almost a third to 90 million within 50 years, according to government forecasts. By 2055, more than one in three Japanese will be over 65, as the working age population falls by over a third to 52 million. The fall in population is expected to be continued as number of deaths is expected to keep rising because of the aging of society, a ministry official said. As the number of women is falling, Japan's population is expected to continue to decrease, the official added. Even if the birth rate rose from 1.4 children per woman to Abe's target of 1.8 and Japan accepted more immigrants, it would be difficult to prevent a fall below 100 million. The main reasons for the population decline are that families are having less children and women are getting married at a later age or not getting married at all. Nearly half of Japanese adults do not start having sex until after they reach 34 years of age, as the majority of young adults remain single in the country, where the population has fallen by nearly 1 million in the past five years. The study, conducted by the National Institute of Population and Social Security Research, revealed that 42% of the men and 44.2% of the women aged 18 to 34 are still virgins in Japan. The trend in society seems to have deteriorated since the last study came out in 2010. At the start of the decade, only 36.2% of men and 38.7% of women said they had never had sex. Furthermore, as the new research revealed, the trend is unlikely to change in the near future as 70% of unmarried men and 60% of unmarried women have still yet to find a partner for a steady relationship. Other factors include pessimism about the future, worries about children turning out as bad seeds, and concerns about the high cost of rearing children. A government poll found that 90% of young people want to get marred and have two or more children. But many people in the 20s are not getting married and having children because of the difficulty getting regular jobs. People working part-time find their income too low and unreliable and employment too insecure to think about raising a family. Young married couples are not having children because of the burden of education costs. A survey in 2009 by the Japanese government cabinet office found 40% of people didn't feel the need for kids even after they got married. Boosting the birth rate in the country is one of the Shinzo Abe, the current Prime Minister of Japan, who aims to raise fertility from current 1.4 to 1.8 children per family by 2025. Prime Minister Shinzo Abe has made tackling the problem of Japan's shrinking population a priority. But experts say averting the looming demographic crisis is virtually impossible.